Hey guys, Ian Holtz or the Freedom Astrologer once again here and doing a video on my morning or during my morning routine and just going to find some lighting, better lighting and I'm doing a shorter one again today because there's been something on my mind and sometimes you know, people come to me with this topic and um, I think it's an important one especially for, for those of you who are um, working with people first and foremost you know in, in this type of console you know consultant roles or one-on-one um, -on -one, uh, consulting roles with people and um, and you're or, or you're just generally more sensitive in tune and you feel things in your body and you feel a lot of feelings and, and uh, let's say energies that are going on around once there's an interaction with somebody in your body and in, in your uh, consciousness. Now, when you do that, very often you do get these sensations and feelings and they are very accurate and you can... You can feel when a person is bullshitting you or when a person is, you know, maybe saying the things that, you know, you know that are not true and then they're kind of tiptoeing and maybe you, you can feel and understand the psychology behind it and you can understand, and maybe see even the deeper underlying where the things are coming from uh, for that person and why they're doing the things that they're doing. Maybe it's a more difficult interaction. Maybe it's a... You know, an argument, whatever it is. Maybe it's an argument with a, with a spouse or, or 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 with a person. The the point I'm making is, you are getting all these sensations and feelings in your body, and, and you're seeing deeply into them. Now, <clears throat> what what very often starts happening is that you go into the space of, of but I can see, you know, I can see that you're you know bullshitting and you're you're giving it out to the other person. And the other person is not receiving it. And, um, you know, sometimes it can happen even, you know, behind the scenes. You know, there's a series of interactions with, with that person. And you go to, to uh, somebody who you can confide in. And you're, you're saying to them, like, oh, I feel this. And I, I, I sense this. And I know that this is going on. And I see deeply into this. And very often... People even come to me with that same same kind of interaction. Like, I know this is going on. I feel this is going on. And uh, I'm a lot in that space of, like, first and foremost, so what? You, you can feel and, and you can understand that things are going on. So good, first and foremost, good for you. But also in those interactions, so what? So the reason why I'm being a little harsh with this is... A lot of those people who you are interacting with in, the, in that, those scenarios won't ever, um, ever admit to you that they're experiencing and feeling that they're actually doing the things that you are uh, understanding. Because this means them also getting caught. You know, you know, this is like, you know, very often these patterns are more, you know, darker, harder, um, maybe even, you know, lying they can be those those things we perceive as negative so whenever you put out or or say to a person like this is what you're doing there usually comes um a fight you know the the, the fighting happens because a denial also happens because what this means this this um discovery usually for the person and, or or the the fact that they've been found out is deeper deeper down if they admit it, if they admit to you that this is actually going on, they will be thought of as bad people. And when you're thought of as bad people, you will lose love. So this is this is the gist of uh, again of this pattern uh, of this video is whenever a person is found out like that, they usually in their consciousness, in their subconscious, they actually are thinking. I'm going to lose love. So this is why the fighting happens. This is one of the reasons why very few people can admit and and are capable of admitting that yeah, I'm I'm doing, you know, I'm not doing the best things. Thank you for, you know, pointing it out to me. I'm going to start shifting this energy within myself and I'm going to start changing. <coughs> so to summarize, good that you're very intuitive, very in tune and and in your feelings and understanding what is going on 
around you use that gift and use it to your advantage definitely and help those people who are more open to it who are capable of, of admitting things and and kind of shifting and transforming um, but don't waste your energy on people who you know and maybe even you've tried to kind of or done your best to kind of call them up on it and, and maybe in the hopes that they will change and shift those patterns with you and in communication with you you know uh, don't waste your energy on that they will you know most likely come to that space later on and um, use your energy with the people you know who are capable of, of changing and, and, and kind of admitting and, and seeing and, and uh, even understand that even if they admit something you know darker about themselves it doesn't mean that they're bad people or, or something bad or they're going to lose love in essence so thank you guys hope hope this video helps uh, for those of you who are more sensitive in tune with feelings and emotions energies and thank you very much for listening watching see you again soon